good afternoon. Good afternoon everybody, uh, you join me here, whoops a daisy, on a million pebbles and boulders that you've probably already seen at the famous Pinnacles here in uh, Victoria and this is, this is what I wanted to come and shoot today. Um, last time I was here I had phenomenal colour um, but we're not going to get that but I again couldn't care less, I'm just having an absolute ball down here. I've just taken a, uh, a panorama um, from this angle here, um, uh, four horizontal uh, one second shots and then four horizontal one minute shots so hopefully uh, they'll blend together and if they do I'll show you them uh, now. Okay, so let's look for composition number two. I think you can pretty much just point a camera anywhere you like around here and, and I think you'll, you'll, you'll nail something. Um, I think the one thing that I constantly look for or strive for uh, in my photography is separation. And uh, it's, get, it's quite difficult to actually get that degree of separation between the elements here. Um, so um, I've walked around and to the left to make this into a single, a single group. What do you think of that? <laughs> what do you think of that? How wonderful is that? Beautiful. I've just got to watch this spray as it's coming in. Um, and the front filters, uh, because the wind is, is this way. Um, pushing it onto shore. water. I'll have to keep a close eye on that. There is coming in thick and fast. I think what I'm going to do is actually change the lens. And I'll put the 32 to 64 on and punch in on that rock and catch some of them breaking waves. There it comes. This is where the great old shower cap comes in handy. I uh, know I'll have to keep an eye on this because I think you are actually fogging up. I can see the spray on you. So if it's on you, it's on this camera here. So. That's where these come in. A treat. Wow. 
before I put the 1.2 on to tame that sky. I'm just going to have a quick look and make sure there's nothing on the front of the lens, which there isn't. And then we can pop on our soft grad, cover it up. And what I can actually do now is I'm going to compose and focus through that. I just want to show you the versatility of looking through a, uh, a, a shower cap is that you're still able to um, function and focus through it and then when you get the right, the right time to shoot you can whip it off, take your shot and pop it back on. So a marvellous invention these shower caps, perfect for uh, what we need to do with this spray. Okay, so let's see what we can do here. And cover. <laughs> oh. And then wipe. <laughs> And look, there's a touch of colour behind you. So the spray is not too bad at the moment, it seems to have died down slightly. So I'm going to take a chance and throw on the six stop. It's at one second at the moment with a six stop that will give us uh, one minute, um, which I think is a perfect length of time. A yeah, perfect length of time to. Uh, smooth out that sky a touch and blend some of those colours that we can see happening behind you. I'm just going to go for it, pull this off. One minute, I'll take a chance on that spray. I'm hoping that this is a lull. We're at 32 mil. And just keep. No, nope, spray is already there. Can you believe it? So. Already there. Well, if this turns out misty which I feel it will, we'll just have to deal with it with shorter exposures, multiples and then deal with that in post. We've got 12 seconds to go, 8, and the waves are starting to come back in, 2, 1, done. Let's give this a good old clean, ready for the next shot. Even on this screen, it's going to be difficult to see if there's any cloudiness or mistiness. I'm just checking to make sure that we've got those pinnacles in focus, uh, which we have.
we're just going to take a very shorter exposure quickly at f22 three seconds just getting that sun star one more three seconds that light is beautiful as the that terrible horrible mist is shooting through it we're getting some beautiful light rays full of bits I can feel it on my face let's wait for that water to calm down a touch I'm gonna pull it back to F16 back to 32 I could back up to a minute Just the composition. Go. Let's keep an eye on that front. Yeah, that's okay. Oh, what an evening, hey? What an evening. coming in now that's not what we wanted we didn't want the big waves but the big waves want to come in come on a few more seconds there we go we can wipe it properly and cover quickly Now that is absolutely beautiful, I think. I'll throw that up and tell you what you think. Let's just flip, compose this. I don't think this one will work as well because it really is facing into that, uh, that mist being thrown up. And two seconds, one second, done. We can wipe the front of this. We can cover it. I'm just going to gingerly and very carefully shift this way. So I'll just uh, very quickly um, show you this uh, composition bumped up the ISO just so you can see that um, so that's what we're working with and take our chance with a two minute exposure oh that was a big pile of spray what well, have we got 50 seconds I can't leave it I can't leave it just got it very gingerly very quickly give it a wipe 
very quickly, very gingerly. Just give it a gentle wipe. 30 seconds to go. Uh oh, we caught it. We did catch that. That sun star. Uh, hopefully, you'd have seen it by now and it was all in focus. That was my worry and it was not misted by this continual, this continual battering of water. Um, we seem to be with luck. Eight seconds, come on, I didn't want a big one. Five, four, three, two, one. There we go. Give it a wipe. Give it a cover. come down if you want make yourself whatever you are whatever you want to take your shot just stand and take your shot and I'll work around you don't worry yeah, all, right. all right thank you everybody thank you for joining me here at uh, Phillip Island at the Pinnacles at Cape Woolmai I've had a I've had an absolutely awesome time so um, all it leaves me to say is that wherever you are please take care of yourself look after each other and your loved ones and uh, until next time see you